What's up, Cruise fam? Welcome to Bimini Bahamas. got a fun field day for you guys today today we are doing something that i thought that i would never ever do we are going swimming with the sharks we have booked the excursion i'm um, snorkeling with the reef sharks so stay tuned we're gonna take you guys along with us let's go but first we're gonna grab a little breakfast all right guys we have made it off the ship we are headed to our excursion point to check in for the Reef Shark Adventure. And these are the tram guys that will take you all over the island. And it is complimentary. So all you have to do is just get in this line when you get off the ship and they will take you to Resort World, all the beaches, the casinos, and they run all day. I think every 15 minutes. But we decided to walk some of this buffet food off. And our excursion point is not very far from here, so we didn't need to take the tram. We are headed to Kayak Beach. The pier is pretty long, guys, but it's not that bad of a walk. Good morning. This is one of the areas that you come to. This is Kayak Beach to sign in for your excursions. And I think we check in over here. Speed race bitch, reef shark. Hello. That's man, reef shark? Yes. Mm -hmm. Tell me about everyone. That's great right over here. Okay. We are at the check-in point, guys. And this is Kayak Beach. I guess I see why they call it Kayak Beach. With all the kayaks. And jet skis. All right, fam, from here we have a short walk to the boarding docks. And this is the area where you will be asked to sign a waiver form using the iPads provided by the touring company. Um, we are about 30 minutes out to our Caribbean Reef Shark site. Um, they were born there. They live there. They are, um, we have about 15 of them. So what we're not going to do is we're not going to chase them. We're not going to hold their tail. We're not going to put our fingers in front of their mouths. We're just going to simply observe them and enjoy your time.
We have life jackets. We have enough on board for everybody. So if you see us grabbing a life jacket and jumping overboard, you guys gotta grab a life jacket and jump overboard. <laughs> the corner there, that's the bathroom. Step down, as the push the flush on the side, step back up and face the road, watch the head. No throwing tissue in the toilet. No toilet. No hugging a shot. <laughs> and if you're if you're on board and your companion or your friend is in the water, there's no throwing anything into the water. Reason being is these sharks are used to being surface fed. So if you throw something in the water and it splashes, they're gonna come up to check that out. And coming up mightn't be nice. So we don't want you to throw anything. You come back to the boat and you hand hand it over or you hand pass. Everybody good with that? Yes. yes. Well,
government found out they were losing because it burned too much fuel so they waved the ship off they put it out of commission but we had a rich Bahamian guy by the name of Bruce Bethel he had a dream of a floating casino so he went to America bought the ship and on his way bringing it back carrying it to Nassau he came across a great hurricane that lodged him right here in the sandbox it's called a great hurricane because it was in the time that they were naming hurricanes as that the ship in the next four years will be a hundred years old flat. It was built in 1926, so 2026 she'll be a hundred years old. But then the American government found out that he did some illegal activity right here. He had a casino here. He had Al Capone and some gangster stuff. They did some drug deals. So the American government gave him a time limit to evacuate the ship. 48 hours. After 48 hours, they dropped a bomb on the stern that's in the back there. And then, as you can see from here, you can see straight through it. Those are bullet holes from fighter jets and all of that stuff. They shot it up and we guys get it as an artificial reef. This is actually one of the bullets that came out of it. My fellow Dekka and guys took up a few weeks ago. Right in the back there. This bullet is probably old. Very, very old. 1900s and stuff. This is a very old bullet. So that's the ship there. People come here, you can swim through it, go back to the engine room. There's lots of fishes at the back there. They be in school. Turtles be here, stingrays be here. How do you get up? Oh. People, they have some safe ladders right there. Okay. They are 100% safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you have to climb them on your own. Yeah, yeah. That's how safe they are. <laughs> we cannot let you do that. Yeah. But they do that and they jump off. Yeah, yeah. Cool. No tall company in Bimini will let you jump off that. You have to come in your own boat and do that at your own risk. Yeah, gotcha. But it's fun though, it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that's it right there. Yeah. It's a concrete ship for you guys that never saw a concrete ship. It was only about 10 of those bills. That's one of the 10 right there. Cool. That's punk. Guys, look at how beautiful this water is.
Alright, alright. So when you guys get back on board your cruise, we'd like for you to leave us a nice comment or review. It goes a long way. But right now we'd also like for you to double check, get all your belongings. The cat, the dog, the kids, the husband, the wife. Anything oh, really? you leave, we will put on eBay. We sell it back to you for half price. <laughs> Don't leave nothing. Just sell it back for half price. <laughs> and as we approach the dock, we like you guys to remain seated clean or to stay seated clean. <laughs> Paradise Beach. This is your free beach. It is no cost to you. You can catch the tram here right from the cruise port. And this is what you will find here at Paradise Beach. I think here the chairs and the umbrellas are an extra charge. But if you just want to save a little money and enjoy a beautiful beach, this would be it. And as you can see, there are plenty of chairs available, but they are at an extra cost. And you can see the ship from here. Now I do see some water sports activities. See jet skis. Now I have been hearing stories of a lot of jellyfish here at this beach. We're not going to get in the water today because we're just getting done with another excursion. And I just wanted to give you guys a look at the public beach here, the free beach.
casino? You want to go to a show? You want to go to the buffet? Oh, you want to go to the club. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Welcome back, fam. We are leaving Bimini. We have already been back to the room, changed clothes, fresh enough for the night. We have a lot in store for you guys. We got a couple of shows we're going to attend. We have some uh, comedy shows tonight. And it is the last night of the cruise. We'll probably go back to the main dining room for dinner. But stay tuned, guys. We'll see you in a minute. Guys, word of advice, don't wait till the last day of the cruise to purchase your cruise pictures or you will be stuck in long lines like this. Guys, it's about 7 p.m. We're about to go check out the buffet, see what they got tonight. And after that, we're going to head down to the theater, check out one of the main shows. have had an awesome time here on board the Carnival Liberty. It is the last night of the cruise. I want to thank you guys for watching. In December, guys, in December, we will be on a brand new Carnival Celebration. A Carnival Celebration in December. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. Till next time, peace.